Well, this morning, we are remembering the man and civil rights icon known by so many as Houston's pastor. Reverend William A. Lawson died yesterday at the age of 95. And our co-anchor, Jacob Roscon, is live for us in the newsroom this morning with how you can pay your respects and the legacy that he leaves behind. Jacob. Good morning. Many know Reverend Lawson as the founder of Wheeler Avenue Baptist Church. Many know him as a civil rights icon. Here he is with Dr. King. He helped lead the segregation right here, desegregation right here in Houston. He was also a professor, a father, grandfather, and great-grandfather. He died peacefully yesterday and will be so missed by so, so many. Lawson first came to Houston nearly 70 years ago where he led the Baptist Student Union at TSU. He and his wife Audrey later founded Wheeler Avenue Baptist in Houston's Third Ward in 1962 with just 13 members and it has grown to more than 12,000 today. He retired as pastor in 2004, but remained a powerful voice in the community. The city has lost a pastor, one who guides, one who leads, one who loves, uh, one who protects, one who encourages, one who sometimes disciplines, and we've lost that in Houston. I think he stood up for people, gave them a voice that didn't have a voice for themselves, and he always fighting for justice. I'm heartbroken. Um, at the same time, I would be selfish um, if I were only saddened and heartbroken. I'm also very grateful for the length of his life and the amount and depth of his deeds. Well, you know, the Bible says that here's the thing that God wants us to do, to walk humbly, to seek justice, and to uh, love, love one another. And Pastor Lawson has done that. He humbled himself. He served the Lord. You can pay your respects at Wheeler Avenue Baptist Church next week. Visitation and a community service planned for next Thursday. The final celebration of life next Friday. Reverend Lawson, you may know, was a father to four, including our very own Melanie Lawson. Our hearts and prayers are with her and the entire family. Live here in the newsroom, I'm Jacob Brascone, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.